Ideas for back to school cookie. Hi everyone and welcome to the Cookie Couture where flavor and design collide. Today I'm going to share with you how you can make super cool back to school cookies just using a rectangle cookie cutter. But first, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and push the notification button and let's get started. For these cookies you will need white and black medium and flooding consistency royal icing. Please click the link above for a very good recipe edible markers, a ruler. You also are going to need a wood stick or if you happen to have a cookie cutter similar to this one, it will be very helpful to do this cookie. I am going to cut out two rectangle cookies. Very good. For the first one, I am going to make some little holes. Every time that you make a hole using a stick, you need to be very careful and check if the wood stick come out on the other end. And also, if you have something like this, it will work also very good. Okay, you know what it is, right? <laughs> then obviously we have, we're gonna leave something like this. Now we are going to bake the cookies at 350 Fahrenheit degrees for 10 to 30 minutes. I think my cookies are ready. Meanwhile, I am preparing my royal icing. Now I am going to use the medium consistency icing in a pastry bag and I'm going to use a decorating tip number 1.5 and I am going to outline the cookie. Now I am going to put the flooding consistency icing and I'm going to let it dry this cookie completely. Now I am going to make the lines using the edible markers and a ruler. And that's it, this cookie is super simple and it looks super cool. For the composition notebook, I am going to start by outlining the cookie. Then I am going to fill up the little square in the center. Now I am just going to swirl them out.
I am going to put black icing here on the edge of the cookie. And I am going to let it dry completely. For the composition notebook, I also put icing on the side of the cookie so it looks more real and I used an edible marker to write down composition book once the cookie was completely dry. Remember that when you're going to use edible markers on your cookie, your cookies needs to be completely dry, okay? For this other cookie, I really really like it, it's super easy, you can write down any message that you want using an edible marker and it is a very good idea to put on lunch boxes. These are very cute. And this is another cookie that I make also using the same rectangle. I make like a little blackboard and I put some apples on the top. another cookie okay I really hope that you like this tutorial and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please don't forget to subscribe and push the notification button and see you until next time bye bye